Losing a loved one is difficult and painful, especially when you're also raising small children. When LAFD pilot Brian Lee passed away in an off-duty plane crash, his family was devastated. Our world was turned upside down when we lost Brian. Cheryl Smith and her three young daughters quickly learned what it means to be part of an extended firefighter family. As leaders from the Los Angeles Firemen's Relief Association and its charity, the Widows, Orphans, and Disabled Firemen's Fund, rushed to her side. They were with me in the days after Brian had passed and helped me make decisions regarding his final wishes. They were here every day and uh, supported other family members and friends that were coming by. The relief made sure the family's health insurance continued and gave her emotional and practical support. It was such an overwhelming time, but the paperwork and the phone calls were so minimized for me, and I was able to take care of myself and my family. The assistance gave her a little peace of mind and helped her cope with the grieving process. We did not have a, uh, a time when I was worried about how am I going to put food on the table. It was important for, for our family to try to continue to be normal. Uh, and not have a huge disruption in everyday life. And uh, even though th there was, I wanted some normalcy. And the relief offered that for us. Cheryl says Brian was a hands-on dad and family time was precious. Now in his memory, they do special little things to keep him a part of their lives. We collect pine cones. Uh, that was one of the things that Brian did with his girls, collected pine cones. Now uh, the girls and I do a lot of uh, remembering daddy. When we go places, we talk about daddy a lot. I want to make sure that I'm raising our children as Brian wanted them to be raised. Cheryl is proud of Brian's career with the LAFD, which includes a Medal of Valor for rescue work during the 1994 Northridge earthquake and his promotion to air operations. That was his, his ultimate dream, was to be a helicopter pilot for the fire department. That was, that was his dream, and as his partner, I knew I had to support that dream. He was born with wings on his back. Cheryl says Brian always reached out to help people, so it's only fitting his fellow firefighters are there for his family when they need it most. Are taking it day by day, good days, bad days, but it's still another day. As they try to adjust, Cheryl has a message for the donors and supporters who make the mission of the Widows, Orphans, and Disabled Firemen's Fund possible. Thank you. To see how Brian's sister Donna Marks is giving back to the charity in honor of her brother, read her story on the website, firemansrelief.org.